So I just unveiled the news that I will be selling my tiny house. My name's Annabelle, by the way, for those of you who don't watch my stuff regularly, which is most of you, so. Um, yeah, I'm selling my tiny house. I built it five years ago, five, four years ago. And uh, you can go watch that other video if you want to know more about why I'm selling my tiny house. Here, I want to address the question of Will I build another tiny house? What will it look like? What form of home or lifestyle do I want to have in the future? So, first thing to address, for those of you who've been here for a while, you know that I purchased a smaller trailer, a very small trailer. Um, I believe it was eight by 10, and it's just out there, which you can't actually see, but, it's right next door and I have all the material and the tools to build this really small, cute little trailer. And I learned how to weld and so I was planning on welding it all myself. I will be still doing that and I will likely keep that for a while. I'm not sure if I will eventually sell it, um, seeing how I feel about this tiny house. I think I'm just someone who will build something, have it for a while, and then sell it. I don't, I don't want to be super attached to one area or one thing. So I will be building that. I'm going to get help with the framing. Um, I want to hire someone to do some welding for me so that I can know that I have a really great structure to my um to my trailer because I ultimately don't want you know I took a half day course in welding and I'm now going to be welding this trailer and I want it to be really good so I guess sort of yes it's very small and I'll show you some pictures now or maybe I've already showed you pictures but anyway um inspired by this other guy who I saw and I was like wow this looks really awesome and kind of perfect and can be towed by a normal size car so that's kind of what inspired that do I plan to build another regular size tiny house like this on wheels no I do not plan right now to build another tiny house on wheels for myself could I see myself building or helping someone else build one, sure. Um, but I am much more interested in building somewhere permanently. And I'm not ready to choose where, where that is. I think what I would like to do is kind of travel around and camp and uh, see where I want to be. Part of me is like, I need to get away from you know, where I grew up for a while and come back. And part of me is just like, you know, there's a couple of properties that are really awesome and have so much potential that maybe I should just purchase a property and start building on it sooner than I might have once thought. So I'm in discussion, but I want to build a permanent house and I like the style of, uh, the cob style where it's hay and clay and I also like shipping container but I likely won't do the shipping container house definitely want it part underground if not mostly underground all underground um, there's reasons for that and if I don't do that I definitely want some sort of a passive solar house and um, definitely like metal outside and a pretty small, simple house. I don't want anything massive. If I have or need more room, I will build something separate on the same property. Yeah, I'm kind of looking now to, right now I'm just kind of hanging out in this space of uncertainty, with certainty that I'm going to be selling this tiny house, but with uncertainty as to what the future looks like, I guess, which is totally okay. 
I'm, I'm okay with not knowing where I necessarily want to be or what the years to come will look like. There are certain situations in my life that are keeping me from knowing exactly where I want to be and in what time frame I can, this, I can explore that and I can execute that. So I don't really know what's going on, um, but I'm just trying to take a day at a time and I know for certain that I wanna sell this tiny house and that I will be making my smaller trailer welded and uh, I will obviously be docu documenting that here on this channel. So hopefully that'll happen in the spring, um, summertime, sometime. Yeah. So I appreciate any of you who hung around and watched this whole video. Um, don't forget to subscribe if you want to see more. And uh, you can follow me on Instagram because I'm very active there. Um, See you Bye. Life is wonderful. Life is wonderful. Never understood. But life.